Brazos County Commissioners have a lot to discuss these days, but at the top of the agenda, split payment options for property taxes. 25 News reporter Hallie Jones has more. The split payment option for property taxes in Brazos County allows property owners a way to divide their taxes into two equal payments. If you plan your budget saying, all right, I'm going to store six months of it away to have ready for January. Last week, the Brazos County Commissioner's Court unanimously voted to end the split payment option for property taxes after a Senate bill passed during the last legislative session, requiring a mandatory election if local governments increase taxes over a 3.5% cap. That's a huge chunk of money for people to have to come up with. So I think the court's thought process was if we tell people early enough, they can go ahead and finish their payment from last year and they'll have time to budget to come up with the payment in January. Brazos County Tax Assessor Christine Rose says doing away with the split payment option would have eliminated any taxpayers from possibly being blindsided. The first deadline for payment is November 30th. If we wait until after the election and everything to start the process and get the bills out, there is no guarantee the bills will get out in time for people to participate in that split payment that have always budgeted for it. Last week's unanimous decision did not sit well with constituents over on social media. Residents like Tony Watson believes this should not have been a discussion given the current climate. It, it's time to right now just kind of go, let's take a breath and, and maybe we put this on hold. You know, this is not an important vote right this moment. We need to be worrying about other people and our constituents and how they're going to survive what's going on. Through civil discourse, Brazos County Judge Dwayne Peters and County Commissioners have listened to the community and unanimously voted on rescinding the decision in hopes the community understands why it was brought up in the first place. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? I'm okay with us removing it as long as people understand that if there is an election for, for somebody that goes over the cap, they need to be aware that they need to check before the end of uh, November and make sure that they've made the correct half pay. If they do that, there's no problem. Reporting in Brazos County, Hallie Jones, 25 News.